up shell squad this is your egg update you wanted it it's coming at you let's look at these eggs let's see if they're let's see if they're any good follow me into the secret room oh yeah i wish you guys could see this it's amazing in here oh that that's cool. oh look at all oh my uh i did bring my light with me and uh what we're gonna do is it's called candling the egg i'm not sure why they call it candling but it's pretty cool um all right so this is a great clutch oh look at that guess who's down here who knows rocky so rocky actually is getting a new enclosure so he's in here temporarily but check this out okay so you guys saw the egg laying video now this is i label everything so this was uh one of the females and she laid five eggs I was able to palpate them on the 17th. Uh, she laid them roughly nine days later. And now we are, um, today's actually May 10th. So let's see what they, hopefully I get this video out for you guys soon. So, um, so what you do is you just turn the light on. And if you hold it to the egg, if it looks like this, where you don't really see much, that's usually not a good sign. But if you see that, you see a blood vessel there? That's an excellent sign. Uh, let's go here there's more blood vessels I see there um, it's under the little dirt patch so you might not be able to see it um, on camera very well uh, the brighter the light the better but you can see this blood vessel very well it's actually a small circular patch there if we go here um, you can kind of see it there as well there's like a this whole area right here on the left half has so it's, a, it's like a red ring, but it doesn't show up very well on camera. There's a huge red ring on that one. This one's the dead one. See? I'm always told by friends, just incubate it, but I know they always go bad. So I give them, uh, you know, roughly a, a month. And once I see any sign of it going bad, I just chuck it. You can see the color difference. They should um, uh, turn white like this egg. They're actually all laid and they look like this if you saw the video. But uh, this is what the this is what they should look like. Not always either though, it's hard to say. So we know we have one, two, three good ones. Let's check out this one here. Oh, I've never done this before. Uh, so I got this uh, New Zealand sphagnum and then I mixed the um, hatchrite and the perlite. That, um, but that's just how it worked out. So and I'm not gonna change it. I like. Almost anything works. And I don't know if you can see the big blood vessels there. So that is how I candle my eggs. Um, some people actually pick the eggs up and will lay them right on top of the flashlight here and uh, then turn the flashlight on. I've seen some people use their cell phones. They'll lay their cell phone out. Uh, so they'll, yeah, they'll lay their cell phone down and um, then they'll just put the egg right on top where they're flashlight is and with the flashlight on and they'll be able to inspect it that way I don't like to touch my eggs um, usually but for you guys I, I'm doing it this time but um, I really don't like to do it so that's how we candle our eggs we got some more clutches coming in so um, it's gonna be exciting uh, these are all selectively bred actually so I'm very happy about it all right so let's go ahead and close those guys up so I get some people that message me about my incubator um, so I have one video already on the channel. You can check it out. It's about a, a nice, uh, easy to make cooler incubator. Um, make sure that's sealed up nice and tight. And the cooler incubators you work very well. I still use them. I always will. But I have managed to get this free freezer um, and uh, from a, a friend of ours. And I need to clean it up a little bit. Um, but she, uh, yeah, their family was nice enough to, to donate this and uh, became a giant in incubator by using these uh, heat tapes. And I got a fan up here. I got a fan down here. Uh, another fan down here. Anyways, this is all rusted out down there. I kind of, I got to start repainting it and everything. But uh, yeah, that is the update. Hope you like it. So that's how it's done. Uh, if you have any questions how to do this, Feel free to comment below. I'll try and do my best to answer them. I do have a light back here. Bing! And I actually um, can control it on and off and on and off and on. Only as much space as you need, so um, I don't recommend such a big one anyways. 
So thanks for watching the update. I hope you're excited to watch the turtles hatching. If you haven't seen the turtles lay eggs, I got another video coming out after this one, probably on the turtles laying eggs. But there, I got a lot. I got I got turtles. They, they're pumping them out. So um, I don't know if I'm gonna post any more videos of the turtles laying eggs after I post one more. It seems kind of redundant. But if it is, if you just if you guys like to see that miracle of of, of birth and then the, the the bonus you know miracle of hatching. And I got you. I got you. Subscribe, tune in, Shell Squad out.